The West Michigan teen is sharing her story on the national level for this year's Youth of the Year competition by the Boys and Girls Club of America. Fox 17 first told you about Isabel Shepard back in May. It's a journey that has taken her all the way to New York and has taught her to never be afraid of telling your truth. It's like a blessing. It's uh, kind of surreal. Isabel Shepard didn't think sharing her story would take her this far. The obstacle of me having an imprisoned father, a father who was imprisoned when I was young, and currently he's still in prison as he was sentenced to life uh, without parole. She competed in the Boys and Girls Club of America's Youth of the Year competition, winning the local competition in West Michigan and regionals in Lansing. Now she's competing at the national level in New York City with five others. Each time it felt like less real, um, kind of like, I don't know, Felt like I was on cloud nine in a way. She arrived Monday with her advisor from the Boys and Girls Club of Greater Holland and family. The competition is Wednesday. She'll give a three minute speech to judges continuing to share her story and struggles. Losing my confidence and not feeling that I belonged anywhere I went. And then I explained how the club allowed me to have that sense of belonging that I felt I lacked and how it also helped me to have that support system underneath me that I knew I needed. There will also be an interview reviewing of additional essays and her resume. On Thursday, all six contestants will deliver their speech at a gala and the winner will be announced. She is compassionate, she's driven and she's ambitious. And um, because of the Youth of the Year program, I've seen her grow and mature and um, to really own and process her story, but to really utilize that and utilize her voice because of this program to be an advocate um, and to allow, to allow other kids to thrive and flourish just like she is. Ty Tannis has served the Boys and Girls Club Southside location in Holland for six years. He, like many others, are rooting for Isabel as she represents West Michigan. She's done a phenomenal job to uh, prepare herself to get to where she is. Um, she is destined for success, so we are um, we are for it, and we are here to support her every step of the way. It's been a journey that Isabel says she's proud of, no matter the outcome. One of the biggest things that I've learned is that it's okay to like feel scared to share your story, but I feel that it's important to, just because you never know how many people you're like touching or how many people you're inspiring. The winner of the National Youth of the Year competition will receive a $50,000 scholarship, a brand new Toyota car, and a $5,000 Kohl's gift card. And of course, we are wishing Isabel the best of luck.